Taurus, how are you guys? This is going to be an energy update for you from October 15th through the 31st. So let's see what's going on with you, Taurus. Taurus, energy update from the 15th through the 31st. We just had a full moon in Aries. So let's see what's going on with Taurus. Earth signs, earth signs, Taurus, Taurus. Goodness. Okay. I guess we shall take all of those. <laughs> so we have awareness, triumph and success, throat chakra, speaking up about something, spiritual strength, partnership and alliances, and love begins. Wow. All right, let's see how these tie into the reading for Taurus. Taurus. Taurus, I feel like you had some awareness, okay, are going through, a, a, you know, in, in a situation where you're gaining some awareness, okay, um, and, you know, you've built up some spiritual strength here, and you want to express some things, voice some things in regards to, you know, partnership and alliance here, okay, where you want some success, some triumph and success, okay, and, and, and this kind of just blossoms, starts to blossom, and this is kind of where the love begins here, so let's see, Taurus, what can you tell us about Taurus? Taurus. Wow, so we have three ones here. One, one here at the top, and one. Wow, okay, okay. Taurus, what can you tell us about Taurus? Taurus, Taurus. Taurus, I feel like uh, I saw the Hierophant and then I saw the Two of Swords in the reverse here. So after contemplation, after searching for inner guidance here, have you finally made a decision? Okay, this decision, okay, about, um, you know, some success that you want here. Some give and take with someone or a situation. Let's see. Let's see. Taurus. Taurus. Earth sign of Taurus. Thank you. <laughs> Taurus, bottom of the deck, we have the five of cups, okay? So, you you know, you could have been in a, in, in, in a state of feeling, you know, lost, grief, okay? Um, you know, self-pity maybe for yourself in a situation here, okay? I feel like you are... A little defensive, yet maintaining control. What's helping you, Taurus, is, you know, the high priestess here, okay, that you are getting in touch with your intuition, okay, your, your higher knowledge, this awareness, this awareness, you are getting in touch with your, you know, the, your subconscious mind here, your inner voice, okay, um, could be having a little, uh, a mysterious aspect to you, maybe some people don't really know what you're planning or thinking or, or wanting to do here, but I do see here that um, you are wanting to, um, with the page of cups here, be a little bit more of a dreamer, kind of, you know, has some happy surprise, some sensitivity, you know, wanting to possibly offer, you know, this, this cup of love to someone. It's, it's just a page. It's a, it's a small thing coming, but it, it, you know, it's like something here new for you. Okay. Um, and your subconscious or hidden factors around you, we have the lovers reverse. So maybe there was a, a, a tense love situation, okay, that, you know, maybe was um, not balanced or, you know, there wasn't any harmony in that situation and, and you've thought things through and you really want success in this, okay? You, you want success in this. Here with the lovers um, reverse, you know, there could have been some separation, disharmony, um, some type of infidelity. Effects of the past, Taurus. We have the Knight of Wands in the reverse, okay? So, you know, you could have been a little impulsive or reckless, okay? Maybe you had some anger in regards to the situation. The Knight of Wands, you know, he's kind of in and out, a little flighty. Maybe you were um, in and out of someone's life or, you know, or maybe someone was in and out of your life, okay? And that's possibly why you're defensive. Why you're defensive here, okay? And the next move is the Six of Pentacles in the reverse, okay? So, strings attached, it's like there's a power struggle domination here, okay? Like holding back, withholding, okay? That's kind of like why you're defensive. We're going to clarify that. 
how you see yourself as the Eight of Pentacles. Very high standards here, okay? You know, putting putting your, your time and, and energy into your work, okay? Wanting to really build something here, okay? Wanting something to expand here. How other people see you outside forces as an empress, okay? Very, very lovely energy here, you know? An energy of, of nurturing, you know, femininity, um, fertility, okay? Something that could, you know, that's abundant here, okay? Someone around you could be pregnant. Or that could definitely, you know, be kind of in your surroundings. Okay, so hopes and fears, the three of pentacles. You're hoping, you know, to collaborate, teamwork, build here. I'm seeing this with the partnerships and alliances. Wanting to, to build, wanting triumph here. Okay, wanting to collaborate. Collaborate here. Okay, could be in regards to work. It could be in regards to, to a love situation. Wanting to build all around and the outcome here until the 31st of October, we have the Knight of Swords, okay? Action, taking action, defending your beliefs, being assertive, okay? Being daring, being a risk taker, brave. It's quick wit. It's, 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 it's it could be a little impulsive, yet yeah, it's a very nice energy of actually taking action after really getting in touch with your intuition here, okay? So why is the six of pentacles in the reverse for Taurus? Why is the six of pentacles in the reverse? You know, which, which really makes sense here. You know, the knight of swords is actually, you know, it could be a communication card. Swords, throat chakra here. It's like, again, after some possible, you know, getting in touch with your inner voice, your intuition, and the spiritual strength here, okay? Coming to some awareness about, about a partnership or alliance here, and you actually want to build. You actually want to put work into it now. Taurus, where somebody wants to, you know, that's how you see yourself here. You want to put work into something. Why is the Six of Pentacles in the reverse for Taurus? Six of Pentacles in the reverse for Taurus. Six of Pentacles in the reverse for Taurus. Yeah. So, you know, you really want some, some clarity. You want some generosity and sharing. You, you want to, um, it, there's some strings attached in the situation though, okay? There's there's still some imbalance here with the temperance reverse. There needs to be an, a, a, new, um, a new perspective here, okay? This could also speak to a hasty decision, okay? And with the Knight of Swords, that's a little hasty in, in himself as well. So why is the temperance here reverse and the Six of Pentacles reverse? Why is the temperance reverse and Six of Pentacles reverse for Taurus's next move? Taurus's next move. Temperance and Six of Pentacles reverse. Two of Swords, okay, how we saw in kind of the pre-shuffle here. So making a decision here. Making a decision. And, you know, it's, it's, it's also, um, you know, seeing the truth. It's like there's no right, you know, right, like the lesser of two evils type of, you know, overly cautious. Overly cautious could be here. But an improvement, wanting, wanting an improvement of, of this situation where there were some strings attached, where it was like a power struggle domination, you know, like, um, you know, not seeing eye to eye here where things weren't balanced or there was an excess or self-indulgence, okay? And really wanting to improve that and like come out of the cold and, and you know, make the situation. What is this Knight of Swords? What is this Knight of Swords for Taurus? Knight of Swords for Taurus. Queen of Swords. Wow, a lot of communication cards here. So Queen of Swords wanting to maybe, um, you know, Taurus, the, the Queen of Swords is a witty person here, you know, male or female, feel free to reverse the roles, but it's, 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 she, he or she is discerning. They're sharp. It's, you know, self-reliance, a, a little bit skeptical here. You know, it's like they've been through it before and, and, and they've learned, perceptive and clear-minded here. And it's like after coming to some clarity, after maybe some, some spiritual strength, after maybe isolating yourself and, and really searching for inner guidance, you know, you've come to the awareness. You've come to the awareness. And now you've taken some action. So why is this? Wow, Ten of Pentacles popped out. Nice, okay. S stability here, you know, inheritance, you know, culmination, like... Just, just the, the family, the dog the thing. Wheel of Fortune here. Wheel of Fortune and the Hierophant, okay? 
wanting to make something more committed, more structured. I want to see why is the Seven of Wands here? Why is the Seven of Wands here? Why is the Seven of Wands here? Seven of Wands for Taurus. Seven of Wands. Not Okay. Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups. Taurus, are you defensive about someone coming towards you being kind of romantic? Or... Okay. It could be here, Taurus, that, um, you know, you're defensive about someone possibly coming in and, and, and expressing, you know, being romantic and idealistic. You know, you, you've had a chance to really get in touch with your intuition after a partnership really wasn't balanced here. And like, you know, this, the, 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 there's still like a little power struggle domination, okay? And, and it's like, you're going to express, you're, you know, you're going to take action and, and, and express um, you know, you're really clear and perceptive and clear-minded here. Um, what else? Why is this Why is this Knight of Cups and the Seven of Wands here? Knight of Cups and Seven of Wands. Knight of Cups and Seven of Wands. Yeah, so you could want to, you know, express and be more, more romantic here and idealistic and follow your heart, you know. But you're coming out of a, you know, out of a, out of a, an energy of, of being defensive, you know, of pushing things off here, you know, of, of, um, coming from isolation. Okay. With the hermit in the reverse. Okay. From a sense of being withdrawn or paralyzed by fear, possibly maybe you were pushing something off. Okay. Because you were paralyzed by fear in a, in a situation here, but now you're, you're kind of working your way towards, towards offering this cup or being romantic or, you know, very clear and perceptive and clear-minded here. Seven of Pentacles. Hard work, perseverance, putting diligence into something. So let's see. What's going on with Taurus right now? Taurus. What can you tell us about Taurus? Taurus. Taurus. Hope this is making sense for someone. <laughs> Taurus. 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 Fourth chakra, the heart chakra here. So that that aspect in you is, 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 is being activated for sure. For sure. It's like, okay, you could be wanting, you know, to act here now definitely with the knight of cups cups here okay wanting to express page of cups here okay you want to maybe express give an, an, some type of of gesture of love or intimacy you know towards someone here and, and this queen of swords could be the person external to you okay but you here wanting to take action for sure taurus okay i feel here like the person external to you might be a little skeptical, just might be a little skeptical, but we're going to see. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and continue this with extended Taurus. We're going to get a look at your person because I want to see what they're thinking. So if this is where we part ways, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.